I'm uh, Heath Maxey. I uh, work at Banker Steel. I do research and development. So when we first started looking at Fab Station, uh, we had a lot of challenges with uh, not having enough skilled labor. Uh, a lot of our guys are kind of aging out to retirement and there's not a lot of new guys coming in. So there's going to be a lot of loss of intellect leaving the facilities. Using Fab Station technology, we can kind of supplement the newer guys along until they get going enough with the skills they need. Yeah, uh, it's kind of made my life easier because we don't have to spend quite as much time training the newer generation coming along. Uh, you know, these guys grew up with the tablets and the iPads, so we're giving them a tool that they're very familiar with so we can just hand it off to them and give them a quick rundown and let them go to work. Yeah, there was one instance uh, we had that Fab Station really, really came through for us. Um, there were these skewed trusses uh, for an airport. They had uh, compound skews on them, so they were kind of pivoting in two different directions. And when we first started the job, we didn't have Fab Station and we're going through and we're getting a lot of the skews are backwards or going the wrong direction. I gave a couple of the guys the Fab Station tablets, put the 3D models and the drawings on there for them. They started using those. And what we noticed was if they had a question about it, which way a skew was leaning or how it was supposed to look, they could quickly snap to the 3D model, see what they were expected to build, which way it was leaning. And it really reduced the number of errors that we had with the skews being the wrong direction. The AR technology, it, it looked a little weird in the beginning. You know, I got a couple of funny looks when we first rolled it out to the shop. I was out there just kind of poking around in the air. Um, but once once I got my first guy in, in the headset and he kind of saw what it was, you know, he picked it up really quick and took off with it from there. No retraining or anything, hardly anything after the initial session that I did with him. And uh, we're just letting him kind of use it when he needs it, when it's benefiting him and we haven't really had to come back around for him. Really anyone that, that is kind of gonna be in the same predicament we are, where you're building a lot of items, you don't quite have the workforce that you need, it's gonna help you with the training. It's gonna make it a lot easier to bring new guys in, give them an understanding of what's going on. Um, so anybody that's building buildings, anything really with drawings, 3D models. Our experience with FabStation has been really good. I initially started with just one tablet, one HoloLens. Um, about three months later, I had guys knocking on my office door every day, asking how they could get one. And uh, so then we expanded, added a few more tablets. Right now, we're just getting ready to roll out another package of tablets to more of our guys. We've asked for a couple of features and they've been right on top of things with us, working with us. They're always asking us if we need help. So it's been a really great experience so ever since the beginning that we started with them.